When I was a kid, I was 10 years old, um, I saw a documentary on killer whales around the island of Newfoundland. And then from that moment on, really, I wanted to go to Newfoundland. When our honeymoon came up in 99, we said, so where are we going this time? And I said, I'd love to go to Newfoundland. It's not like your honeymoon type of destination maybe, but for us, we love nature. So that's what we did. And um, well, it was beyond our expectations because I mean, yeah, when you like nature, you love it and you get to get here. We were overwhelmed. So this is the tub I use to uh, take out on the boat. Um, I have a real camera bag, but I find, you know, when there's a bit of spray, it's just waterproof enough. So this is the main camera. When we're here, there's no schedules. Uh, we live by the weather, which is hard this summer. Um, but really we check for the wind and the wind decides whether we go out or not. Sometimes there's nothing out there that you can see directly from shore. So I must say it's really nice when we go out there. Um, we just go out in the bay and then we decide shall we go left or do we go right. So I must say those moments are nice when you don't know where they are. Because then when you find them it's more like a, like a present, right? Like oh there's a blow there or whatever you see. and. Um, so yeah, it feels like a reward when you can, when you actually find a whale or whatever's there. Well, what you see on, in my photos is just moments, they're shots, even my videos are short, but uh, I must say when you're out there and uh, you spend a lot of time with them, like we spend about four, five, sometimes six hours with a couple humpbacks and it, it gets different, like um, they could get really interested in you and um, well by observing the animals I get a lot of information to shoot better photos. I do feel you get more intimate with them um, because their behavior will change. Um, we approach them uh, to a respectful distance and we just watch them. We keep our distance but we watch them and we watch them and you will find that the whales come here to feed and that's what they do like I would say 90% of the time. But there will come that moment that they become relaxed, they just hang at the surface or they come to you, come towards the boat. And then it gets intimate I would say, yeah. It does feel like a second home. Um, it's really funny because when we're leaving Holland, which is home, uh, we're sometimes sad to go here but then we get here and we feel like home and then we're sad to leave this home so really we got two homes and we feel very fortunate that that it is the way it is for discover nl i'm gage miranda